Good morning. Guess what? Point for Mexico. <laughs> Point for Mexico. No points for Davy today. Oh. All right, my friends. This little paper is muy importante. Let me tell you why. Let me explain. When they got on the when we got on the plane coming into Mexico, they gave us a paper and they were like, fill out both pieces. They'll take this part. They'll give you back this part. You need to bring it with you when you come back. And I heard it, but apparently Davy didn't. And he lost his. So we get here this morning and she's like, you need to go get a new one. I was like, oh crap. So I walk over there. I was like, I need a new paper. And he's like. Uh, okay, fill it out. So I filled it out and he's like, it's $30. And I'm like, I don't have $30. And he's like, well, it's $30. I'm like, you don't take cards? He's like, no. And I'm like, well, I don't take, I don't take her. And I was like, I don't have $30. You don't take cards. I'm sorry. And I kind of went to grab for it. Like just to look at it again or something. I don't no, know. I wasn't stealing it. it. Yes, I wasn't stealing it. So he says, take your hands off it and get out of here. You come back tomorrow. I was like, oh, easy buddy. So he was, he was pretty mad at me. So I found money. He tried to shoplift his no, paper. No, I wasn't taking his paper. <laughs> so I went and got it and paid $30. It was like a $50 fee on the ATM probably to take money out. Yeah, they got us. They got us. So. Reminded us of the first point for Mexico when we first got here was we decided to rent a car when we were booking our um, flight and hotel because it was like 30 bucks for the whole week. Dave was like, oh yeah, that's awesome. We'll just get a rental car and drive everywhere instead of taking taxis and stuff. Well, we got to the airport, got on the shuttle that took us like three or four miles over to the rental place. We get out, we're buying the rental car and all of a sudden they tell us, oh, well, it's $400 for the insurance and you have to have it. So that's how we were like, oh, it was too good to be true. Yeah, it, if it's too good to be true, it probably is. So we were like, never mind, we don't want it then. He's like, okay, then I will do you a favor. I will charge you $50 and we'll take you to the hotel, to your hotel for $50. And Davey was like, no, I'm not paying $50. I was like, it's $50? The rental car was supposed to be 30 for a week. Yeah, he's like, and you I'll wanna pay charge 30. me 50 for a taxi ride? So he's like, oh, when didn't you offer 20? Yeah. Like 20 bucks? You're like, I'll pay you 20 bucks. And he was like, no. At the airport, you'll pay $80. I'm giving you a deal for $50. And at that point, I realized that we had no more cards to play. You got to know when to hold them, know when to fold them. I was like, fold, fold, Davy. Let's just pay the $50. And then he was, but he's like, no, I lived here for a year and a half or two years, whatever. I know that that is a ridiculous price for a taxi. So he was like sticking to his guns. He's like, speaking Spanish to him. He's like, no way, I'm not paying you that. So he's like, fine, I'll take you to my friend. No, first he offered 30. 30. Third, or I offered him 30. And, and he acted like he was gonna take He's it. like, okay, yeah, I'm gonna take you over to my friend. So I was like, okay, your friend's gonna take me for $30. So In our head, like, miscommunication, I guess. Cause he just. No, he didn't say, all he said was, I'm going to take you to my he was friends. Like, okay, I'm gonna take you to my friends. So he takes me over to this place <laughs> near the airport. And it's there's- It's just like, no one's around. There's a van and six Mexicans there with a price list that says $80. Yeah, he like, just, he throws our bags out on the side of the street and just drives away. We're just standing there like. So I proceed, <laughs> it's Davey versus six Mexicans and. A paper that they're says $80. All just, they're all just against me and the paper that says $80. And there was like, I didn't even see how we would get out to a road and then the road that you could see was like a freeway. We were just, just and I'm like, walk on the wait, freeway. I was like, what, what is this? Where's the airport? I want to go to the airport. And they're just like, it's $80. So I was just trapped in this, the place of their friends and. And they made us pay before we got in the car. He's like, too. you need to pay me right now. <laughs> so I, it was just ridiculous. So I came, we came, we were joking the whole time that oh. there was a point system that every time I got screwed, a point Mexico for Mexico one. every time I didn't listen to or a lie a or got a good deal like when we rented golf carts 
the guy that sold me the tickets was like, it's $55. It's cheaper here. It's, he's like, you're not going to get it cheaper there. That's the best deal you're going to get. I was like, no, I think, yeah. I was like, I think I can get a better deal. We walk off the boat, immediately there's one for 43. First off, for 43, first, I'm like, I probably could have shopped around more, but I was like, yeah, 43. Uh, you, the further you walk away from the boat dock, probably got cheaper and cheaper. So that was a point for Davey, but overall, it was pretty even. Mexico got me quite a few times, but I got them quite a, few, a number of yeah, times too. But so I realized that almost every person that we came in contact with lied to us. Yes. Almost every, every single one. <laughs> Except for maybe the people at our That's hotel. how they make money off the tourists, is they lie. A lot of lies. Anyone just straight on the up street, lies. They're like, you're not going to get it cheaper than that. Not like, not that's lie. just or a lie. Or the lady that we went to breakfast with, she was like, it's. 30 minutes for breakfast and then one hour for the presentation. Yeah, all the timeshare stuff. And, and like everything she told us seemed really shady. Then we get there and then she even changed it right when we got there. We got in the taxi with her, gone over there. Right when we get out, she's like, okay, so they're gonna eat breakfast for a while and then after breakfast, she'll go to a new room and then at the 90 minutes starts. And we were like, what? No, before you told us 30 and then an hour. Now it's a full 90. Anyway, it's just everyone's life. So lesson learned, beware of lies if you come to Mexico. <laughs> But overall, it was a good trip. Yeah, so. no, no, it's it good. was pretty even the point system. It's just like it was bad. Honesty and integrity is not valued as much as where we're from. I don't think. <laughs> no, I think it is. Just with the tourism, they know they can get away with it, but there's nothing we can do about it. So yeah, it's that's like, what I meant. I'll lie to like, you. like in that business on the street, especially like just say whatever you They'll need just to say. say everything to you go. anything you want to hear. It doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah it just <laughs> lies. But, um, yeah, so we have a little flight to Houston, then an eight-hour layover. Maybe we'll play a little bit when we get there. We'll see. This might be our last vlog for the day, but... Really? No, it won't be. One take? One take. No. There's no way. There's going to be That was not... Many, we have a long day. We things. will people watch. We will have a lot of fun. And I'm, I'm just glad I got... I'm able to go on the flight. When I was over there filling out my paperwork, it, I felt like I was about to be thrown in Mexican jail. They would do that. I got nervous. My heart started racing. You, you wrote that you were a girl on this paper. That's a fe female. <laughs> what the heck? I dude? saw the M for mujer. For M, I just saw M, male. Oh, <laughs> you're a girl. Ah, Point Davy. <laughs> All right, you guys. We've almost made it through our eight-hour layover. We've been watching movies on our phones. We like both zombies. watched several movies on our phone. It's way too long to hold on a conversation with each other, so <laughs> we've been doing that all week. Oh, please. <laughs> we were just wanting to watch a show on our phone. We were watching different movies and then we ended up watching the same movie, but I was ahead of him like But individually, minutes. and she's like, let me tell you what happened on it. <laughs> Sorry. Sarah Tom approach. So, yeah, it was a good movie. We're, uh, now April's learning about volcanoes. Yeah, documentary style, girl. That's what we call her. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna fly home and see our kiddos. We're excited. I know, we're almost there. What time is it? 3.30. Okay, so my most entertaining part of this airport has been the little carts that drive people by on. They don't have horns on them, so we call them vocal horns. And we're gonna we're gonna demonstrate the vocal horns with April. That was good. We got good vocal card. Vocal vocal horn. Okay, we're on the plane, ready to go home, and we were just talking about how my drone video is going to be on the John Oliver show tonight. Davey, you're talking really bad. They asked for permission. <laughs> they asked for permission to use my video. And I think that they're going to make fun of him, so, because the, they're paying him, so. Yeah, they, I made them pay me. They were going to pay me. That but. means that they're not going to make him look good. <laughs> so. Look for it on YouTube. I'm sure he puts all his videos He's funny. there. He swears he, a yeah, lot. Yeah, we started but watching like him. him. His latter Just videos, they edit his his yeah. older ones. They didn't edit. I his like F when they out. beep him out. I yes. get what you're saying. I just don't want to hear. But yeah, he's funny. I agree with them most of the time, though. He does some good research and he researched into Miss America, FIFA. The Miss America was funny. <laughs> 
All right. Oh, and I let sent April to pick out the sandwiches. I uh, probably failed. I got the cold cut trio from Subway. Apparently that has bologna in it, and nobody likes bologna. I don't even know why it exists. May as well put spam on it. That's the same thing as bologna. They are different. As soon as I saw them put it on, I was like, oh. But they are both non-meats. But then I thought, the meat's disgusting, so maybe I'll put all the vegetables that I don't like on it. And maybe it will balance it out. Two negatives might make a positive. So That is not true. Yeah. But she got gummies. I don't not so put vegetables on it. So it makes it okay, right? Well, I don't not put vegetables on my sandwiches, so. See? Double negative makes a positive. Means I do put vegetables on my sandwiches. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, let's see. So I snuck in, I didn't have the camera because I was scared, and I hugged Ender and it was really nice. Ow, so your beard hurts. I like your and beard. I like your beard. You hugged Ender? I feel like I'm getting a cold sore right here. Where's your sickle there? We gotta All right. go. Um, Good night everyone. We will be ready to hang out again tomorrow. Yes, thank you for coming to Cancun with us. That was really I hope, fun. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye. Say goodnight everybody. You said it.